Hello again, everybody. Today we are going to be doing the review on the eFire. So the eFire is a very unique device. Uh, it's hand handcrafted, um, wooden battery. Love this thing. Check this out in the case. I love when companies do this with the case and they give you a nice presentation when you open it up. Feels like a really nice, expensive cigar or something. Uh, very nice presentation. It's got a nice wooden box. Uh, seems to be put together well and uh, so yeah you take it out of the box and it's a hand carved wooden battery um, so every single one is unique uh, no two are made the same so in saying that I've got a one-of-a-kind device here which is really good and uh, they packed a lot into it actually um, it's got the beauty ring as you just saw me screw on there as well as it's got variable voltage on the bottom here it goes from 3.3 Rate or yeah, 3.3 .3 rate over to 4.8 volts. Um, so you just spin the bottom ring, and it's actually very smooth and uh, well, well greased piece of equipment. It also comes with a tank. I don't think the tank has a name, but uh, we'll screw that on there and see how she works. Now the tank actually has a very nice design for a wick tank. Actually, um, I personally am not a huge fan of the wick tanks, but uh, this one actually seems to be pretty good. Um, it's got a button on it, you just uh, push the button, no lights, no nothing, uh, and you go ahead and vape. Let's vape this on, uh, let's go to 4.0, oh, let's go to 4.0 and see how she vapes. Very nice cloud of smoke and uh, yeah, um, she's got some balls to her, I'll give her that, she's got some balls. Um, it, you know, throwing on other tanks as well. Sometimes I don't usually like using the stock tanks, especially if it's a wick tank. Uh, drop down wick, I should probably specify that. So I take off the beauty ring here and throw on the new uh, Aero Tank Mini. I love this tank because you can change your airflow and it's mini. Um, one of my tanks, uh, one of the first tanks I started vaping on was the uh, Any Vape David Mini. Um, and I used to love that tank. Like it was a nice small tank. The problem is I vape constantly throughout the day. So I was going through three or four tanks of juice a day. So I probably vape probably around six, uh, six milliliters a day. Um, this does the same, but you can change the airflow and it's just a much better, a much better made tank. Um, and they've included the airflow, which, uh, if you know me I love the Nautilus and that is one of the only reasons I love the Nautilus is because of the uh, the airflow that I can control so maybe these one of these will become my new favorite who knows but uh, let's try it out with the uh, with the aero tank mini here that hits good that's uh, gives you good power and I've got peach gummies in there right now so that tastes delicious it's got great um, flavor to it and uh, yeah it's working really well um, I'm really liking the handmade design on here it's uh, you know it's a one-of-a-kind battery it doesn't look like the rest of my mods so it really sticks out in your collection um, I think it's around $80 this is around an $80 mod uh, some places sell it cheaper some places are more expensive um, you know it, it all depends on you know where you go really um, I don't like to throw out too many prices in my reviews you know just because prices change and I don't want to come back and review something I've already reviewed so um, go check it out uh, it's a really good really good battery and it works with uh, any tank that you got so go out and get one uh, one of your own unique handmade wooden batteries does uh, comes with this tank does not come with this tank in case you're just tuning in comes with the regular wick style tank so for Oshawa Vapes I'm Joe Earl and thanks for watching